As we told you in the previous video, those excess processes can have a big impact, not only on the performance, but it could mean that you're infected. So if you find that you've got a lot of excess processes, here's what you can do. If you want to take a stab at cleaning up your excess processes, launch the task manager, which will show you a list of all the running processes. You'll notice all this stuff's jumping around. If you click on image name, it'll sort all the processes alphabetically. And you can see across the line there, a lot of times it will tell you what each process is. If you recognize the program, you're good to go. These are the ones that you want to be concerned about. If they're blank, they could be one of two things. It could just be a simple part of the operating system, or it could be malware. The more of these blank items you have, the more concerned you should be. If malware is lurking in your computer, the items that are listed as system or the current user are most likely to be where this grime is hiding. If it's not obvious to you what each of these processes is, you need to do a Google search for each one, figure out what it is, figure out whether you need the program or not. Click on Start, then on your control panel, and then click on Uninstall a program. You'll see an alphabetical listing of all the programs that are installed. Right click on the one you want to get rid of, and then click on Uninstall. As you can see, getting rid of those excess processes takes a lot of time and some tech skills. So if you don't have the time, the tech skills, or the stomach for all this, you need to get some help. And if you don't have somebody that you can trust to take care of this for you, we're here to help you. Simply mention this video and get a 10% discount off of our comprehensive cleanup service at any Data Doctors location in the country. Just go to datadoctors.com, click on the store locator, put your zip code in, and we can help you.